most embarrassing thing that's happened to me. You caught me by surprise there, Mr. Winfield. Uh, it was on the train on the way to this interview. I was sat next to this smart gent. He told me my earphones weren't plugged into my phone. I was serenading the whole character with Joyce Grenfell. <laughs> no, that's not it. It was when I went to the toilet to relieve myself. I couldn't work out how to lock the door. Could have done with the gent to show me. <laughs> I had to go, so I sat down and hoped for the best. I got more than I bargained for. And God, the stench! Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Sorry. And then I saw it in a massive mirror, me on the throne and the gent. Yeah, the door had opened on me. He could see me doing my business. He could probably smell it too. Oh, sorry. I couldn't get up, but I was still going. <laughs> Closed eventually. But I was so flustered, I dropped my phone down the pan as I flushed. <laughs> Luckily, I'd used lots of paper, so it didn't actually touch the number twos. <gasps> I'm so sorry. <laughs> it was what you could call a shit journey. <laughs> I'm oh, so sorry. Actually, I can really recommend this case. It kept my phone quite dry and it still works. In fact, as I was fishing it out, it rang and it was you, Mr. Winfield, <laughs> asking me to confirm I was coming to this interview. <laughs> it's strange, though. Your voice sounded um, kind of familiar. No, not this actual case. No, I chucked that and got another the same off Amazon. It'd be very wrong to be using a case that had been in a pan of poop. <laughs> oh, God, I'm so sorry. Um, excuse me for asking, Mr Winfield, but... Um, did you get here by train? You did. OK. I guess that's it then. Thank you for seeing me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs>